keeping this party going here at T-Mobile Park. Opening day. Opening Can you day. believe we're doing this right now? This is just so much fun. Um, we're bringing another guest here. We've got Mandy Lincoln. She's the Senior Director of Experiential Marketing. Welcome. Thank Hi. You. I you love your been? outfit, too. Brand, branding, the marketing on point. You got to have it. Hi, Mandy. How are you? Hi. Good to see you. So we have All-Star, the whole All-Star All -Star Week, All-Star Game. Yep. For the first time since 2001, yeah. the last time the All-Star Game was here, we won 100. We won 116 <laughs> games, went deep into the playoffs. We're going to recapture. We're going to do it again. I yep. can feel it. What preparations? Now I know that a lot of people think, wow, the preparations are getting started now because the season's underway now. No, you guys have been preparing for how long? <laughs> Uh, since 2018 or 17 well, is when we had to uh, submit the bid to wow. actually get the game. Yeah. I barely plan ahead one month. <laughs> no, I'm really impressed by that, Andy. That's a long time to prepare. What can people expect? That, that's, that's preparing your pitch to say, hey, we want to host the, sure. the All-Star Games. You're working with the city to say, hey, this is what we can offer. Choose us. And then it was in uh, fall of 21 when MLB said, okay, Seattle, you've been granted the 23 All-Star Game. So really have dialed things up in the last two years or so. That's incredible. How can people get tickets if they want to come to one of the games? Yeah, so um, we do have ballpark events, whether that's, you know, Saturday Celebrity Game, if it's the Monday T-Mobile Home Run Derby, Tuesday All-Star Game. You know, we've had a tremendous fan response since September of 21. <laughs> uh, so a lot of season ticket members have come on board to, to snatch up most of the seats, but you can still become a season ticket member and get priority access to a sale should more tickets become available. So I have to do that here, I think, by April 17th. But, you know, we offer, you know, one of the things, we, we want to make sure that people can have an all-star experience, even if it's not here at the ballpark. It could be... You know, if you're fortunate enough to get into the game, but right across the street here at Lumen Field will be Play Ball Park, which is just a ballpark fan fest of Love sorts. Love it. Where, wow. you know, there's going to be kids running around on fields, clinics, autographs, photos, lots of uh, Mariners alumni affordable way for the family to, to get out and experience All-Star. Yeah, that's smart. Yeah, and of course, this is not your first rodeo doing this, putting <laughs> this on. So what is it that you want people who come from all over the country to know about T-Mobile Park, about this city, about why it is so great to come here? Yeah, I mean, it's you know, we're working with Major League Baseball to make this uniquely Seattle. People come here, they know that they're, they're in Seattle. So whether that's here at the ballpark, if it's next door, and again, you're having your ballpark experience here, whether it's at some iconic locations, which will soon be announced of, of you know, some other activations, just putting our best foot forward as a, as a city. Because this really isn't a Mariners event. We've been working with Major League Baseball, but also City of Seattle, Visit Seattle, the Seattle Sports Commission. Everybody's rowing in the same direction to really put the best foot forward for that full been like the best reaction you've heard from someone because you're all about experiential marketing so like any, any people that were amazed by what they saw or anything like that any comments from fans you know we did something a little unique last year when we debuted the logo mm -hmm. we called it a logo drop tried to make it you know this can't miss event at the ballpark and so we partnered with t-mobile who we usually have our friday fireworks with but we also added a drone show for the first time oh. wonderful in ballpark history. So it was just really a cool, unique way to celebrate that moment. That is beautiful, Mandy. Thank you so much for joining us today. Yeah, yeah. It's been a pleasure talking okay. to you. <laughs> yeah, now let's check in with Brian, see what he's up to. Hey, 